What's up guys and welcome, you are watching Fezzy Fitness. I want to start this video with our Sufin and his response that might be helpful to a lot of young up and coming bodybuilders. And not even just pro bodybuilders, even normal people like us who loves to train who loves to go to the gym. Because we are living in a day and age where everyone wants to jump on the gear to get instant gratification without realizing the risk factor. So Tower Sufin is a top classic physique pro. He has been a runner up at the Olympia twice already. And he has won two Arnold Classic titles. And that is one hell of a resume. And when he was asked what were his plans for 2024 year, this was his response. Yeah, we all know Towns is gonna make sure he does all that he can during the offseason to improve his physique. And that is exactly what every bodybuilder aspires to do. But do read the final line as well. Even a top classic physique pro who I'm sure has more connections than 99.9% .9 of the population is gonna search for better gear. This can be very thought provoking for a lot of the people, including myself. People who use all this underground gear, underground lab stuff, just based on the word of their suppliers. I know this isn't a physique update, but that is definitely worth mentioning. The Egyptian tank Hassan Mustafa is up next. The sheer amount of weight that Hassan is moving in his recent training update. That is definitely a clear sign that he has fully recovered from that tricep tear. That happened just a week before the Olympia this year. But still with that tricep tear, he managed to show up at arguably in the best shape of his life and he secured 11th spot, which was his career's highest. So as of right now, he intends to have a very long offseason this time, improve in certain areas. I'm not sure that he wants to get any bigger at this point because he already is one of the most muscular men in bodybuilding. He needs to somehow improve his overall symmetry and enhance his re -taper. He is so impressive in the side and the back shots, especially when he is fully shredded. But the thing is, he loses so much ground in the front shots, like the front relaxed pose. And unfortunately, those are the ones which make the first impression on the judges. Hassan has all the mass in the world. He just needs to figure out the perfect combination of size and conditioning at the same time. Jose Maria aka Middleman is now officially transitioning into the U12 class. It is gonna be a long road for him in the bigger division. But this is 100% a perfect move for him. If I'm not mistaken, he had to sit out of the shows in classic physique that he prepared for for months and months because he just could not make the weight cut off at the end. So in the U12, he will have plenty of room to grow. And I think his physique is better suited in a division like the U12 instead of classic physique because he has that kind of frame. He looks like a proper bodybuilder and not a classic bodybuilder. Middleman has the most unique looking muscle bellies when he is stage ready. So round, so 3D and with the added mass, with all that fullness, he is gonna be so much more impressive. No show has been picked as of right now, but he will be on stage in 2024 in the 212 class and hopefully qualify for the Olympia next year. So hit the thumbs up button if you liked the video. And smash the subscribe button if you wanna come back for more. Thanks for watching.